Have you ever wanted to become an ultimate powerful, ultimate powerful warrior? Well, now you can. That's right, today we're playing a slashing simulator. Not to be confused with the game it copied, Ninja Legends. Okay, so guys, I think it's time we start this video the same way we start most of the simulators games we play, and that is to go straight to the shop, which you can see just over here, and once you get there, we need to buy ourselves the 10 times coins boost, and that's just gonna make us super powerful from the start. <laughs> okay, and um, once we've done that, guys, we're also gonna buy ourselves some coins just to get us started up. Only 25 Robux worth because we don't want to go too crazy at the beginning. Okay, but still, guys, 3.96 million coins is a lot of coins inside of this game. As you can see, if I wanted to buy this egg or chest right here, it would only be 53.25 thousand coins, which is literally nothing compared to what we have already. And seeing as that we're going to quit four pets, guys, I think it's time that we buy four of these pets. And let's see exactly what we get. Okay, this is the first pet we get. We got ourselves an ox. <laughs> okay, so I'm pretty sure that was an epic. And look! Oh! As you can see right there, that was an epic pet. Oh my goodness, our first go. Why do I always get so lucky with pets? I don't know, but I do. Okay, and here we go for our next one. We got ourselves a rare, which is still pretty cool, guys. We got ourselves a rare wolf, which I'm guessing is, uh, it's pretty good as well. Let's see if we can get the 5% pet. That would be, like, super epic if we could. So here we go. Oh, oh, a, a cow. Okay, I didn't want a cow. Okay, but guys, that means one more chance at getting ourselves an epic pet to start off our adventure with. And here we go. We got ourselves a wolf again, which I'm pretty happy with. So now we have these amazing pets. They're going to give us a boost, guys. It's going to help us get up to the top island. So let's grab our daily rewards just like that. And let's begin by heading to the shop and buying ourselves better things because I don't want to be selling every five seconds at the minute. So if I just go to buy all like that. There we go. I should have bought a pretty good sword. As you can see, I need to unlock a new island to get new features. I'm also going to buy myself uh, more souls in the soul shop because that is the capacity in which you can hold things, guys. And now, as you can see again, we need to go to the new island to unlock better things. Okay, but guys, I think we're going to need some skills because to get up the islands, you're going to need more jumps. And we only have one jump at the moment. So I'm going to pop in here and let's see if we buy all. As you can see right there, it says double jumps triple jumps five jumps and 30 hit does that mean each time we hit the boss we get 30 hit points is that oh oh my goodness it does indeed we get 30 hit points every single time but guys like i said we need to start heading up to these islands upstairs and let's get ourselves something much better because otherwise wait what is it what is this over here Plane rewards? Are you kidding me? There's just rewards on the way up to the islands? That is insane! And a group rewards as well? Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. We Wait, do I have to be in their group to get this? I think I might have to be in their group to get that. Okay, let's keep jumping up and hopefully we don't fall down. Okay, this is the next island, which means a better shop right now. So I just got killed by a piece of cheese. Okay, but still, we managed to make it to the plane island. Let's go to the plane island now, and let's buy ourselves something from the shop. So, uh, obviously, we're going to need to buy ourselves some more jumps. Will we unlock some more jumps? We only managed to get this one. Oh, okay. Things are getting quite expensive now. We actually need to do a bit of work to be able to afford some good things. So, uh, let's just start selling a bit right now, and then, then we will upgrade ourselves. Wait, guys! <laughs> Look above my name. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it literally says baby slayer. And I have Bob Bob Milks next to my name. I'm not a baby. You're a flipping baby. A boo boo baby piece of cheese. Whoa, guys. I just pressed buy all. And we've managed to buy all of the swords except this one on the way up to the next island. So let's just uh, start doing this. In fact, actually. What? Oh, I am so sorry. I did not mean to kill you, uh, cat, sir. I'm really sorry. I honestly did not mean to do that. I feel so bad right now. Okay, guys, we're on the way to the next island right now, and I am really excited to see what is at the top of this island right now. Hopefully, the next island is super powerful inside of this game. Oh, no. I'm not going to make it. No. No, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. I do not like falling down off islands. It is the worst thing possible. Ladies and gentlemen, if you hit the floor at an alarming rate, you will be squashed like a tiny piece of pancake dough. Okay, guys. I have really been struggling on this one bit, and I don't know how to get past it. 
this island right here seems to be my only option. There's nothing else around me. And this is the max number of jumps you can currently have in the game. So please tell me, why is it when I jump up to this island, every single time I get right near it, something incredibly bad happens? Why? Wait, guys, I just reset the game and all of a sudden now I can jump like super far. What the heck? It must have been like a glitch or a bug or something, but I'm, uh, I'm not too sure. But either way, right now we are on our way to the next island and this has been so easy for us to get to. Kapow! And let's grab ourselves the desert rewards, which isn't much, but it's something. Okay, and let's buy all the swords we possibly can. Okay, the next one is 100 million, which is a lot. And also we need to buy ourselves some souls. So let's buy all of these as well let's see how many we can get okay we managed to get all the way to water soul which is pretty impressive and now let's see how much we make every single time we sell oh my goodness we're making billions every single time we sell this is insane also, I just killed the piece of cheese that killed me earlier. Okay, and now we just need to buy all the souls. We now have the fire soul for the hottest merch in the game, which you guys can grab from my group shop right now. Limited time only. And that's right, ladies and gentlemen. But remember one thing. <laughs> that's right. Don't touch the merchandise. Okay, well, now our jumps work. We know the nine jumps is incredibly powerful. But how about we get ourselves 12 double jumps ladies and gentlemen we just destroyed desert island and i believe with my tiny little brain that we are on our way right now to the one and only frozen island or ice island or whatever it's called all i know is guys wrap up tight because it's going to be chilly okay and guys here we go we made it onto the island i don't even know what it's called but i believe it is a very cold island in fact look who it is it's the one and only carly351 carly how are you doing this fine afternoon i hope you're having a fantastic day but let me tell you something carly don't touch the merchandise you Ooh. flipping randy up <laughs> I, I, I guess I kind of deserve that. So now it's time for us to buy some more swords. So let's just press buy all and let's see what swords we actually get. So we're getting winter swords, which I might I add 52 billion each. That is like a lot of money. Oh my goodness. And uh, now we need to buy ourselves some souls as well. But I definitely know one way we could definitely speed this game up, guys. And that's by coming to the boost selection and buying ourselves 10 times coin boost. Because I believe our last one ran out. It did. So now we have a 10 times coin amount multiplier meaning now we're gonna make hundreds of billions of dollars that's right which means now ladies and gentlemen we can now afford swords that are also worth hundreds of billions of dollars and for some reason they have 800 billion there and they need to buy the next sword which is uh, only 600 billion so if you wouldn't mind sir i will i will equip the ice dragon slaying sword please also guys it is gonna be time for us to start opening some more pets so here we go let's see what we get this is one of my favorite parts of these games so here we go i got a couple of bears and a legendary dragon which is unbelievable every single time i open an egg i get a good one so we're gonna do that again and hopefully this time we get ourselves something even better so fingers crossed here we go we got ourselves an impossible Cerberus dragon. Oh my goodness, ladies and gentlemen, that was that was pretty insane. We're gonna do one more just for luck to see if we get anything else that is crazy, but I don't think that we are. We did it again. We got another impossible. Guys, we're at the next island now, which is Lightning Island, meaning there's only one more island after this one. A.K.A. Waterfall Island, home of the most amazing swords, home of the most amazing souls, and more importantly, home of the most amazing pets. Whoa, guys, I just got two lightning pets in one go are you kidding me and i almost got the one percent lightning pet which i really want though i'd have to technically open up 100 eggs for me to be able to get them and i don't think that is ever going to happen but i still managed to get myself a couple of lightning pets which is pretty cool let's check the stats out on these pets oh my goodness 
Oh my goodness. Okay, these are insane. We're gonna unequip the unicorns and equip these. And this is a game changer. Okay, guys, we are literally just seconds away from making it up to the top island, which is the last island inside of this game. And also, the place I will be spending time grinding and taking out pieces of cheese. Hey, you're flipping her, Andy. Take that one. Can I take her out as well? Oh, I took Carly out. Oh, jeez. I guess I kind of deserve that. <laughs> okay, it's time for us to open up some brand new pets. And guys, we managed to get ourselves a waterfall pet almost straight away. So let's take a quick look. Oh my goodness, a 9% pet already. And what is the best pet inside of this game, guys? It is a 1% pet. So we actually just got the second best pet in the game. And I'm going to have to check this out right now. 263, are you kidding me? Wait, guys, we got the Sea Hydra. Oh my goodness, finally we managed to get the number one pet inside of the game. At least I think we just did. It's not showing up there, but let's just double check. We got it. Ladies and gentlemen, we got it. The actual Sea Hydra. Okay, let's unequip whichever pet we have right now that's not that good and replace it with one of those. Guys, this is taking way too long. So I think it's time for me to do something crazy. That's right, I'm going to the shop and buying myself plus four pet slots because otherwise... This is going to take way too long. Okay, now, guys, let's buy ourselves some pets that are going to speed up this process. Guys, I managed to get myself the one sword away from the end of this game. And once I reach 1.09 SX, I will be able to buy the sword. <laughs> as simple as that. And as you guys can see from the left of the screen, right now, we have just achieved that goal. So let's head into the sword shop right now. And without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen let's buy the best sword in the game here we go we just bought the sun grace the bow sword and guys as you can see that is so cool that is literally what guys i am so powerful right now i can literally take anyone out but yes guys that is going to be it from me today if you guys did enjoy this video then please do hit the subscribe button what are you waiting for alternatively leave a comment or suggestion in the comment section down below and i of course see you all in the next video good